Dad, I'm really happy we got to hang out today. I love you, and I'm proud to have you as my pop. Thanks, Jack. Feel the same way. Today's gonna be a great Freeze, day. Freeze, criminal! Get out of the car right now! Wait, what's going on? Is everything okay? We finally got you! This is a mistake. I, I didn't do anything. Hey, hey, what's going on? We know exactly who you are. You're wanted for 55 bank robberies. 55! No, he didn't do it. You got the wrong guy. Let him go. You're coming with me, you criminal. No, 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 no. I'm not going to let them take my dad away. I'm going to clear his name no matter what. Uh, where do they go? Oh, they got to be here somewhere. Man, I think I lost them. Oh, where are they taking my dad? Ah! Ah, we found the car. Mel, we're coming for you. What? Mel? That's my dad. How do you know him? Oh, you must be a stupid son. Get over here. What? No. Oh, what the heck is going on? Can't escape me. Get back here. I gotta find somewhere to hide. Oh, way to go. Oh, come on, kid. Where are you? Uh, okay, I think I'm safe. Think again. Ah, get away from me. Hey, get back here. You can't run for long. Finally made it to the police station. My dad's gotta be here. Hey, excuse me, I need to see my dad. Uh, what? Who do you think you are? Oh, uh, my name is Jack. You guys just arrested my dad. Yeah, well, we're not gonna let you see him. Your dad's a highly wanted criminal. We can't just let anyone talk to him. Obviously. You have to let me see him. He didn't do anything. Do you understand what I'm saying, you idiot? You have to let me see my dad, please. I don't have to do anything I don't wanna do. Shut up. You need to stay out of this, son, if you know what's good for you. This is police business. No, no, please. Uh, there must have been a mistake. My dad wouldn't do something like this. There's no mistake. Now, come on. Let me drive you home. Well, thanks for the ride, Officer Thompson. Hey. Hey, Jack. What? Who are you? I know what's going on with your dad. Wait, what? What do you know? Who are you? Uh, uh! What? Where am I? Hey! Get me out of here! Sorry for bringing you here like this. I don't want you to know how to find this place. What? Who are you? What's going on? Why'd you kidnap me? Something bad is happening to your dad. He's about to take the fall for someone really dangerous. And once he does this, the city is going to fall apart. What? My dad didn't do anything wrong. How would he get involved in this? Your father's a really smart investor. And this criminal organization tried to make him steal, but he wouldn't. So they decided to seek revenge. He would be the best person to frame. That's insane. It's not fair. Listen, I'll stop them. I'll prove my dad's innocence. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not, tough guy. Can't do it alone, but I'm willing to help you. Why? What's your deal? Why are you helping me? This criminal organization, they killed my dad. I've been wanting to get back at them ever since. It's time I take them down. We gotta go. Hurry! They found us! What? They found us? I think the two of them in there. Let's go. Who are those guys? Why are they after both of us? They're after me because I have information that they want. What information's that? I infiltrated their gang a while ago. I tried to be a part of it. I didn't want to get that high up and get noticed, but I had to find a way to lock up the person who killed my dad. <sighs> well, I don't blame you. My dad is gone, but at least yours is savable. I want to help him. Thank you. Maybe we just need to find someone else we can trust. There has to be some good people in this town. I doubt it. You have to face reality, Jack. There's more to this than you know. I'll hide. Go answer the door and keep it quiet. Okay. Oh, Officer Thompson, what's going on? We need to talk to you about your dad, Jack. You've got to come with me. Hey, what? Why? I, I didn't do anything wrong. I know you didn't do anything wrong. You and I just need to talk. That's all. Now come with me. Uh, well, okay. I trust you. All right, just admit it, Jack. Your dad did it, and you better confess. No, I'm not going to confess to something my dad didn't do. I don't even know what you're talking about. Oh, really? We have evidence linking him to robberies. All 55 of them that's been going around the city. He's going to be going away for a long time. You know that, Jack. Really? What evidence? I want to see it. Hey, leave the kid alone. We got a new lead. Really? Excellent. Sit here. Listen, Jack, your dad tried to use his one phone call to call you. He needs your help. Really? Yeah, come with me. Jack? Dad! Son, I'm so happy to see you. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I need you to go see my friend, Rodney, okay? He's a lawyer. He'll be able to help us. Uh, absolutely. Uh, I'm going to do everything I can to clear your name. I know you will. I don't know what's going on, but it could be dangerous. Please, please be careful. Don't worry, I will. Where is he? Oh, that must be Rodney. 
Hey, uh, Rodney, thanks for meeting with me. Yeah, no problem, kid. How's your dad holding up? Uh, not too well. He didn't do any of this. They're accusing him of a bunch of stuff. It's insane. No, I believe you, Jack, and I believe your father. This whole thing doesn't make sense. How could they try to pin something like this on your dad? I mean, your dad's a good person. He bought me a meatball sandwich last week. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure out, too. They're accusing him of 55 crimes. I, I think there's something bigger going on here. Something bigger? What do you mean? Well, I overheard some guys talking about a crime boss. You think he's the one who got my dad set up? Okay, okay, Jack. This is something I can work with. I have connections in the criminal underworld, believe it or not. I'll see what I can find out. Ask my friend to look around for us. Thank you so much, Rodney. I really appreciate all your help. Yeah, no problem, Jack. You and your dad are like family to me. Hey, boss, this kid is starting to get a little too much information. We gotta do something. Ah, Fred, don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. What did you do, Jack? You can't just go around talking to anyone about what we're doing. This is super serious information. Don't worry. I'm not scared. This guy Rodney's gonna help us. I just want my dad back. What, what was that? I don't know. I, I can't do this anymore. I I'm out of here. You're just being paranoid. Where are you going? Do you know who I am? Uh, can I help you? My name is Tony, and I know that little punk Fred has been running his mouth to you about my organization. Organization? Wait, are you the one who locked up my dad? It was necessary. What do you mean it was necessary? You took my father away from me. You're a monster. Listen and listen to me closely, punk. You're going to testify against your father. Understand? What? No, I'm not going to do that. I'm not afraid of you. <laughs> well, maybe you should be. If you ever want to see your father again, you'll do exactly as I tell you. We'll be in touch, Jack, real soon. <sighs> no, Dad. What am I going to do? Listen, I've been thinking a lot. Maybe you should just confess, Jack. I mean, this could all go away. Are you kidding? What's wrong with you? I thought you were supposed to protect my dad. Now you want me to lie and send him to jail forever? There were only like 55 bank robberies. It's not too bad. I've dealt with a lot worse. Trust me. Maybe they'll be lenient on him. Only give him 150 years Are you or listening something. to yourself right now? What is going on with you? I'm not going to turn in my dad. I'm going to free him and prove his innocence. You need to be realistic, Jack. I am being realistic. Realistic. I'm not throwing my dad in prison for something he didn't do. Ay ay ay. Things could go real bad for you, Jack. Just confess and make it easy for all of us. I don't care how bad things will get. I don't need your stupid help anyway. Thanks for nothing, Rodney. Order, order! This court is now in session. We'll be trying Mel here with the charge of 55 bank robberies around Roblox. And how do you plead? Uh, your honor, I plead not guilty. Yes, of course you do. I need to call the first witness. Um, Jack, Jack, please take the stand. So, we heard that you're going to confess to us that your father committed these crimes. What? I never said that. I'm not confessing to something that's not true. Oh, uh, that's not what we heard. All right, this is ridiculous. Is he lying under oath? No, I'm not. My dad's being set up by Tony. He's a crime boss. <gasps> That's right, I said it. I don't care. Do something to help my dad. You ripped my family apart. Order, I said order. Officer Smith, arrest this man for being in contempt of court. Come on, kid, you're coming with me. What? No, I didn't do anything. This way, hurry. What are you doing? The cells are in the courtroom. Get in, now. What the heck is going on? Okay, kid, get out. What are you doing? Do you work for him too? No, of course I'm not. I'm giving you another chance at life, kid. You need to stay here. Another chance at life? What do you mean? You just made so many enemies in that courtroom. And you said Tony's name publicly. Now everyone is going to be looking at him. And he's going to be looking at you. You're in danger now, Jack. Good! They all need to get exposed. And Tony needs to be stopped. Look, Jack. There are a few good officers like me that have been trying to bust them all in secret. But now you just open a can of worms for everyone. And things are going to get more difficult from now on. So what am I supposed to do? Just give in and let my dad go to jail for something he didn't do? They basically kidnapped him. And they're friends. Him. I know, I know it's messed up. And I know you want to save your father. But now everyone is going to be looking for you, kid. Let the police do their job and stay out of this. No, I'm going to fix this. I don't care. I'm going to save my father with or without your help. Goodbye, Officer Smith. Hey, Fred. Shh, 
Keep it down. Right, right. I I'm sorry. I'm glad you met me here, Jack. <laughs> ah! Hey, what the heck was that for? You almost got yourself killed. And worse, you almost got me killed too. All right, all right. Calm down, man. I'm sorry. It's been pretty hectic. We need to help each other, though. Yeah, things are really bad right now. And they're even worse for your father. <sighs> Trust me, I know. But everything is going to be all right. We need to take Tony down. What do we have to lose anymore? What do we have to lose? Oh, I don't know. Maybe everything. These men are dangerous, and they will stop at nothing to keep us quiet. Well, somebody needs to put a stop to them. We can't let innocent people suffer for what these guys are doing. And I want my father back. And I know these men took your father too. Please, Fred, I need your help. Uh, fine, I'll help you. But we gotta be careful. We gotta be smart about this. No stupid stuff, got it? Got it. All right, so where do we start? All right, Jack, I don't see anything. What are we looking for? Anything that can hold important information about Tony and his gang. Just, just keep looking, we'll find something. This place is completely abandoned. I bet all important information is just gone. Well, we have to try, come on. I don't see anything, nothing here. Ugh, all this looks like junk. Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. Uh, I think I found something. Looks like some kind of old laptop. Oh my gosh, Jack, is that what I think it is? I think so. It's loaded with information about the gang. Oh man, we need to get this to Officer hey. Smith. Stop right there! Uh, oh, great. Now we've been caught. Not yet. Run! We have to get out of here! <laughs> keep running, you little twerp! Just keep running! We have to get this laptop to the police! And look at this. I think this is a list of people that are getting paid off by Tony. Wow. It looks like there's hundreds. I mean, look at how many people Tony controls. This is insane. Oh, hey, hey, look! Rodney's name is on here. I knew something was up with that guy. They're paying off my dad's lawyer too. Oh, I don't believe this. You smell that? Something is really wrong here. We have to get out of here now. Go, run! Ah! Oh no, the laptop was inside. Don't worry about that now. We can't stay here anymore. We were followed. We have to go. But all that information, everything's gone. It's useless to us now. Let's go. Jack, are you sure about this? Positive. Just follow my lead. Jack, what are you two doing here? You can't be here. Officer Smith, we have nowhere else to go. We need your help. We found some important information and our hideout was burned down. We're on the run. We don't have anywhere else to go. Ah, oh, that figures. We need you to protect us. We found a laptop with more than enough information to put everyone away. What? You two just put yourselves in a whole lot of danger by coming here. Oh. But I know who I can trust and I believe in you. This is more than enough to take down everyone involved. Oh, that's great. So what's the next move? Next move is that I take you to a safe spot where you can stay until we have enough evidence to make a move. But you have to promise me that you won't come back here again. It's too dangerous for all of us. What? No, that's not fair. I want to help. You already helped enough. Now promise me that you won't interfere anymore. We promise. Right, Jack? <sighs> yeah, we promise. Oh, boss, you're here. Well, what happened? Uh, everything was destroyed, boss. Destroyed? Ah! How could you be so careless with that information, you idiot? Uh, I'm sorry, boss. It was out of my control. Ah! Oh! You talk too much. Ugh, oh, Jack is a dead man. He's taking things now way too far. He should have stopped when he had the chance. <laughs> He'll pay for this. I'll make sure of it. Oh, I hate sitting around here doing nothing. Fred, what are you doing? Working on finding weak spots in their hideouts. One of their guys is a total idiot. We can get in there and find more information. No, no, forget that. We need to go straight to the boss's mansion. That's where we'll find the real dirt. Tony's mansion? Are you serious? Of course I'm serious. Tony's mansion is going to be heavily guarded constantly. That man is insane. Going there is just asking for trouble. I don't care. This is for my dad. In fact, this is for everybody. Well, it's way too dangerous, man. We can't just barge right in there, especially after what you did. Tony is looking for you. Oh, yeah, you're right. But there has to be a way. I think I got an idea. Okay, I got everything I need for this plan to work. 
hope no one notices me. Wait, what is this? That's right. The criminal known as Mel has been found guilty on all charges and will be sentenced to life in prison without parole. What? No! Oh, this isn't right. They took my dad. They framed him. They ruined my life. They'll pay for what they did to my family. I'm coming for you, Tony, and I'm going to take you down. How could you let this happen? Hey kid, I did everything I could. There was nothing I could do. It doesn't matter. My dad is going to jail for life now. He, he might never get out. We have to go to Tony's place. We need to find evidence that will prove my dad's innocence. You're right, Jack. We can't allow Tony to keep ruining families like this. He has to be stopped. Exactly. We're gonna take down Tony. Listen, kid, I'm sorry about the news. I, I tried as much as I could without getting caught, but we need more evidence if we're gonna take down someone like him. If that's the case, I need you to get me into Tony's place. What? Are you crazy? That's suicide. You'll never make it out alive. It's too dangerous. Just listen, I have a plan. And it might sound crazy, but it might just work. I don't know about this, Jack. This isn't gonna work. Just trust me and act natural. Uh, fine. Let's just get this over with. Hey, what's the password? Um, the boss told us to come in. He's expecting us. You wanna make the boss mad? Leave us out here. That's fine. That's your own funeral. Okay, okay, fine. Go ahead. Wow, that actually worked. Yeah, these guys aren't really smart. Now we've gotta find some information. Let's go. Let's see. Here it is. Jackpot! Okay, make sure you grab as many files as you can and then stuff them into the bag. This has to be some legit evidence. We'll take care of everything we can and sort it out later. Hey, I hear someone in there. Someone's coming. We gotta hide. Hurry. Hey, what are you guys doing here? Jack, run. Oh, not so fast. Fred! No! <laughs> You're next, kid! I don't believe this. They took Fred. They took everything I care about from me. I'm going to stop them. We'll stop them, Jack. We'll make sure they'll pay for everything they've done. We'll get justice for your friend and your father. I should take some of this evidence. We could split it up so it will be harder to destroy. Hey, don't worry about that. I'll look through it all. You, on the other hand, should get some rest. You look exhausted, kid. I can't rest in a time like this. <sighs> Officer Smith, I'm, I'm worried about my dad. I, I need to see him. No, you can't. It's impossible. They got him locked up tight. It's too dangerous, Jack. I don't care. I want to see my father. I want to make sure he's okay. I can't let anyone else I care about get hurt. Okay, okay. I may have a friend on the inside who can help us out. See what I can do. Settle down. There's no use getting yourself worked up even more. You've been through enough already. I'm so sorry, Fred. I'll stop Tony for all the things he's done to everyone. Me and you. He can't keep getting away with ruining people's lives and families the way he did to yours and mine. It's not fair. He took your father's life. Now he's taking yours? He's sick? I'll make sure he pays for what he's done. For you and your dad, Fred. And for my dad, too. You better watch out, Tony. I'm coming for you. You're going down. You know, this is a really stupid move, right? Tony will be expecting you to be here. And who knows? You might have people working on the inside. I know, I know, but... I have to see my dad. I need to make sure he's okay. You understand that, right? You know, you're really stubborn, you know that, kid? You have five minutes. If you don't make it out, you're on your own. Okay, thank you, Officer Smith. You, Jack? Uh, yeah, um, here to see my dad? Yeah, come this way. Officer Smith said you have five minutes. Dad! Jack, wh what are you doing here? I had to see you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry for everything that's been going on. It's okay, son. I just don't understand what's happening to me, but I'm glad to see you're okay. I'm glad to see you're okay too. Dad, you've been framed by a crime boss called Tony. He set you up to take the pressure off of his gang. And since you wouldn't work with him, you were an easy target. What? Hey, what are you doing here? Oh, Dad, oh, I'm sorry, I have to go. I'll find a way to get you out of here. Just be careful, Jack, okay? I will, Dad. I love you. Love you too. Now go. Come on, Jack, let's go. We're out of time. <laughs> Okay, I gotta look over this evidence. There has to be something here. Wait, look at this! There's a list of everyone who's received payments from Tony! Every amount of it! Oh, every single person on this list is connected to him! Oh man, I gotta show this to Officer Smith! Oh, what's that? Who's there? I've been looking for you. Oh, great! Can't hide anywhere in this city! Give me that laptop! It belongs to the boss! The boss? You work for Tony? Isn't it obvious? 
Now hand it over. Not so fast. <laughs> Are you serious? You want to see how serious I am? Yeah. <laughs> You're not getting this laptop back. Man, how do they keep finding me? I'm running out of time. All of Tony's goons must be on high alert. Gotta talk to Officer Smith. You can't keep me here like this. You have to let me go. Not a chance. We're not letting you go until you give us some answers. I'm not saying anything. You better. We need to know everything you know about Tony and his gang. Unless, of course, you want to be locked away forever. Uh, fine, fine. I'm sick of Tony anyways. He's been using us for far too long. I want to change. Plus, his breath smells real bad. And tell us everything you know. If you let me go scot-free, I'll tell you everything. Business contacts, base locations, everywhere he hides his money. Anything you want will be yours. But I need to make sure I won't get in trouble. Oh, don't worry. We won't let you get in trouble until you testify in court. Testify in court? No. No way! I'm not going to court. You can't make me. No. You wanna bet? Those are your two options. Testify against Tony or go to jail. It's your choice. Ugh. You know, I really don't like you. Ugh. Fine. I'll testify against Tony. I don't want to go to jail. I don't belong there. Then I suggest you quit your nonsense and start spilling. Now get a piece of paper and a pencil. I got a lot of information. You better write all this down. Because I'm only saying it once. I know he's out here somewhere. Well, well, well. You think you can just walk the streets of my city and I won't notice? Actually, Tony, I've been looking for you. I've been meaning to talk to you about something pretty important. Oh, Jack. How many times have I warned you now? But you just won't listen, will ya? I don't care. I won't back down, Tony. You can't keep ruining people's lives. I'm going to put an end to your crime spree. <laughs> Look at you. You really think you can tell me what to do? You're making things worse for your dad in jail, you punk. You really, really should have listened to me. I won't let you get away with everything you've done to so many people. Your crime stop now. This is not going to end well for you, Tony. Actually, this isn't going to end well for you, Jack. Oh, uh, no! Try and run away, but I'll find you, and I'll get you. Thank goodness. I don't think anyone else followed me. Hey, Jack, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I lost him. Are you ready? Ready as ever. I uh, hope this works. It will. Trust me. Thank you all for coming. I know that this city has been taken by Tony and his criminal enterprise. You've all fought the good fight. I think it's finally time. We have the evidence to start arresting the people that are working with Tony. Yeah, those guys are losers. We got to arrest him now. Yeah, he's an absolute menace. This will be dangerous, but I believe in all of you. This will help all the innocent people hurt in Tony's wake of crime. People like my dear friend Fred, who were killed by one of Tony's men, and including my dad. We have an eyewitness who's willing to testify, and we have documents of exchanges, including the conspiracy to lock up my father. This crime wave ends now. Let's go and take this city back. Hey, put your hands up. You're under arrest. What? No, no, no! This must be some kind of misunderstanding! Yeah, yeah, tell it to the judge. Officer Thompson, you're going to jail. What? Don't be ridiculous! I'm a police officer, you can't arrest me! You mean former police officer. Hands behind your back. No! What? This is outrageous! I am a judge! Correction. You were a judge. You have the right to remain silent. Wait, you I say left me off for the oven. No, no! Jack, should have had more faith in you. You've done an incredible job bringing these guys to justice. We would have never been able to capture half of these perps if it wasn't for you, kid. <sighs> Thanks, Officer Smith. But honestly, I couldn't have done it without your help. You've been amazing. Yeah, trust me, I know. We're really starting to make a difference. With a good chunk of his partners now put away, Tony's criminal empire won't last much longer. With all of them out of the way, we should have no problem bringing him down. This city is going to be crime-free soon, and I'll get my dad back. They got the Upper West Side, the East Docks, and Central Park. All of my territory is getting taken away from me. Ugh, how could this be happening? How could you idiots fail me like this? I didn't know, boss. I thought he was just a stupid kid. I swear, I did everything I could. You didn't do enough. 
They're arresting everyone! My whole criminal empire is falling apart! I I'm sorry, boss. I I'll try to fix it, I promise! No, you won't! You're useless! You know what? I'll just take care of this myself! Uh, boss, are you sure? Y you don't have to do that. Shut up! Clearly none of you idiots can do this right! I gotta take matters into my own hands! What are you gonna do? Simple! That stupid idiot we locked away has another hearing tomorrow, and I'll be there. Boss, you can't be out in public like that. It's dangerous. Don't you think it'd just be better if we lay low for a bit? I don't care. I'll make sure things go smoothly, since I can't trust anybody. I can't even trust you. Oh, come on, boss. You can still trust me. How was I supposed to know a kid would be able to take down an entire crime syndicate? You failed me for the last time, number one. But don't worry. I'll make sure everything goes my way. It always does. <laughs> uh-huh. I see. Well, after carefully reviewing the evidence presented, it is clear, and I have come to the conclusion that Mel is innocent of all charges. This man did no crime, and he's free to go. Uh, yes! Yes, I knew it! We did it! Jack, I am so proud of you, son. Furthermore, I hereby order the arrest of Tony. He has been implicated in this conspiracy, and he will be brought to justice. Uh, I gotta get out of here. Hey, Tony, where do you think you're going? Oh, you. What do you want, idiot? Haven't you caused me enough trouble? Not this time, Tony. Oh, yeah? Watch this. No, not so fast. Huh! Oh, oh, oh. It's over, Tony. You're going away for a long time.